You doing boys and girls? And welcome to another episode of Landed No Streetwalks with extra wobbles and hobbles thrown in for good measure. <laughs> Yeah, here we are, end of the season, and if my calculations are right, it's a hundred days till Christmas. <laughs> okay. We have to let people know, don't we? Radio, we're heading down now to Upper Moston Street. And we've got the Gresham and the Irish Bar. And the London, and all we're past them in a minute, and fountains on the corner here. Oh, but unsteady tonight, but just take me time. Well, as my mum used to say, take your time and hurry up. This bit here, the fountains, they used to be the pet shop. And they obviously bought them out. I remember uh, got our, our dog Ben from there when he was a puppy. A good few years ago now. They're all they're all in that big uh, chasing bones round and cats in the sky now somewhere. Sounds a bit lively in there. A few a few in there having a pint. Can't see him, but I can hear him. Ooh. Over there, there's the all the takeaways. There's the Irish bar, home cooking, King's House. And the Orm fish and chip shop. I have to think a few years ago nobody used to really come up here of a night. But then the the upper part of town here it's like all got uh well got more popular I should say really with the Friday Saturday night crowds. Cause the Irish bar and all of them never existed years ago. All that was up here was the London or the LC as it's called now. And the Gresham, that was the only, only two pubs up here at one time. And the Conservative Club, of course, which is down here on the right. But the rest of it was all, there was just a couple of, there was cap, where Fountains was, that was a cafe. And where uh, Fat Cat says, that was a cafe restaurant as well. I say they're all bars now. Can't the club closed? Good God. I am surprised. I am surprised. Well, I'm making my way down to Spoons for the Monday night ritual. And why not? View there on the Carlton corner. Yeah, it's a uh, it's a bit cooler tonight, but not freezing. It's people sat out there in t-shirts and all that stuff. They're, they're either brave in it or thick skin. <laughs> Indian restaurant doorway there, the Blue Elfin, and the Ormo Lounge, and a big van in the way of everything. 
Oh, we have another bus. Oh, yes, we have. There we go, the 12. <laughs> I, was, <laughs> I was looking at the van. Oh, there's another bus now, see? What's the saying? You Never a bus and then two come along at the same time. Taxi. God, strong smell of spices coming from that Indian there. Well, I like spices. It smells like a powdery sort of smell. If you know what I mean. <laughs> Go meet Oxblood now. Hopefully he's got us a table and got the beers. Yeah, he has to go downstairs for him because I can't. That's great, isn't it? Blocked the path. Getting this fellow out here. Airplane. Yep, here we are. At the old spoons, I'll just go to the edge of the pavement here to finish off. I'll give you a view of spoons and a last look at the town there. It's a golfer's here, look. All freezing now. <laughs> okay, here we go. The old weather spoons. Leave this one here. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one. Adios, amigos.